Imagine stepping onto a plane, grabbing your seat, taking off, having a snack, watching a movie perhaps, landing, and then disembarking, just as you would for any other flight. Except this time, there is no pilot, no one at the controls, and the whole flight is operated by a computer, with no human intervention whatsoever. This is the concept of pilotless planes, a concept that has been in the minds of many people for quite some time now, and one that could one day become a reality. However, the question is, will pilotless planes ever manifest? And more importantly, will anyone ever fly them? Of course, much of today's flying is done with the help of onboard instruments, with pilots manually flying the aircraft for only a few minutes on average. However, contrary to popular belief, aircraft do not fly themselves. Pilots are constantly monitoring and adjusting aircraft systems and navigation, communicating with air traffic control, and preparing for the next phase of flight. However, a report by UBS, a Swiss multinational investment company, stated that the technology for pilotless planes could arrive as soon as 2025. If and when this were to occur, the transition would likely happen over the course of many years, with cargo planes being the first to incorporate the new technology. After that, business jets and helicopters would be next, with commercial planes being the last to go pilotless. But why would we want pilotless planes in the first place? What are the benefits attained in comparison to more conventional flying? Well firstly, and most importantly, the shift would allow the aviation industry to save a lot of money. A large portion of an airline's funds are spent on training and employing pilots, so eliminating this would mean a lot of extra cash for them. This in turn would mean cheaper fares for passengers, as airlines would have greater flexibility in pricing their flights. A move towards pilotless planes could also help reduce expected pilot shortages over the coming decades. An annual forecast released by Boeing last month said that both passenger and cargo airlines are expected to buy over 40,000 new aircraft by 2036. This means that they would have to find and train over 600,000 new pilots to fly them. If autonomous planes were to come around and become a reality, they could potentially alleviate some of that demand. Of course, the flip side of this is that if pilotless planes do become very popular, many existing pilots would be out of a job, and potential or aspiring pilots would have to look elsewhere. However, I think the underlying question to all of this is, will anyone ever want to fly on a pilotless plane? And this is where we get into unstable ground. A survey of 8,000 people conducted by UBS found that a mere 17% of respondents would be willing to fly on a fully autonomous plane. Naturally, the driving factor of this is fear, which is something that would take the general populace many years to overcome. However, it's interesting when you compare this to something like driverless trains or metros, to which no one ever seems to bat an eye. Of course, the notion to this is that there is much less that can go wrong on a metro as opposed to an airplane. Anyhow, let me know what you guys think of this. Do you think pilotless planes will ever become a reality? Also, would you ever fly on one if it did? I'm really curious to hear you guys' thoughts, so let me know in the comment section below. As always, thank you for watching. I hope you all have an excellent day, and I will see you all very soon.